Hello again, it's Priscilla Batzel in Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Art Studio Gallery. And I have been staring at this twice gold primed canvas for a couple of days. I have some leftover colors from earlier and some stuff I want to go away from containers that have just been sitting around too long. I am going to try my best to not overdo. Yeah, but we do know me. I'm not really capable of that very easily. My plan is to use my little scoop from Hobby Lobby that came with three or three other scoops for four bucks. Three bucks? Three bucks. Three bucks. I like all these colors. I don't like that bug on my bottle. <laughs> I do want some white in there. It occurs to me that I usually very much like the uh, the green gold with the gold, and I'm not actually using any gold. Yeah, I'm already going past my comfort zone. Oh well, never mind. I think that requires some more bright stuff. Let's just do that. And I know I started with the orange, and I don't see it anymore, so I'm going to have some more of that too. Because I can! And I have a couple of choices. This one is the one I'm going to take. This is the Prussian blue, and I have Deco up pouring medium in there, and that means that it's going to sell really nicely. I'm just going to use all this paint. I could also just pour it right, right onto the canvas. I was, my original plan was to do a gold and turquoise, but um, honestly, I don't much mind what goes on. It's the end of the day. We got quite a few t minutes left. Let me put that someplace I can actually rest it again. My Princeton Catalyst Art Tool spatulas are going in the bucket when they got paint on them. I'm going to try not to spill anything. And this is a planned ribbon pour. Just like I've been working with my black matte background canvases has made me want to have a colorful background. And I love that red right there. I haven't been doing a whole lot of tipping lately. I have been doing a fair amount of skewering and I was using my basting brush but I've misplaced it while I cleaned my studio up. I think I mentioned that. Alright, so I need another scat catalyst spatula and I'm just going to take some of this and put it there. If I need more colors, I will. I think my glasses would be good. Oh look, and they're on my head. That's cool. All right, the one thing I really didn't use very much of, or any of, is that yellow. And I think I'm going to try and see what happens. I'm going to take a moment and allow myself the pleasure of continuously adding some more colors. I wish I'd left the tops off my squeeze bottles though. That would have been just so much easier. This is fun. This is kind of different. And I like that color orange, but I like this color just as much. And I think I'm going to have some of that with it. Yep, ribbons mean ribbons. And I can continually dip my spatula in if I so desire to whatever color I have. And by the same token, I can use my squeeze bottles and bamboo skewers of any given size because I break them all the time. And paint leads to paint, so I can fill in if I so desire. Well, it's nice and wet anyway. I really do want to, uh, to pull that down. I'd like to see what happens if we if we tip a little. I think I love this color pink and I want to use it and maybe if I'm lucky I'll be able to swipe some out with that. Just creating shapes that I like. 
I didn't bring all my paints out today or I'd be searching hardcore for some white pearl. I don't think it's here, so I'm not going to look for it. I can use my spatulas right in, right inside my little scoops and take that paint right out. And I can also, if I'm lucky, if I'm very lucky, oops. Steel paint and let paint move. I guess my opportunity is here. If I like the idea of getting into that turquoise, and I do like that idea. My opportunity is here for whatever I want as long as I'm fast. And paint leading to paint is cool because Everything will merge with whatever you put it next to so long as it's wet and it's just a gentle prod and it will do what you want, do your bidding, if you're lucky. And I like that and I like that and I've got my favorite color over here. I think I'm going to use some of that. I haven't put any black in this mix and I'm kind of feeling like I want some. It's just a fun composition and I am. I'm composing as I go because I can. And I'm um, loving that, really I am. I've got more color in here. But I can then drip right out if it doesn't become too muddy. Big if. Got all kinds of colors just hanging around. I like the idea of the black. I'm not sure I have kind of applicator tip on anything. Oh, that's neat. Let's do a little bit of that. Thorny. I see a lot of things that want to tip. I also see something I would like to change, because I would like to add some color. Scrape off my spatula. And just call it fun. Yeah, I'm having a good time. <laughs> I know, I'm such a child, I know. <laughs> I'm almost done, except for the uh, I want to be black and I still want it to be black but I think I've used up most of my colors and I don't feel too bad about that I like that orange up there better than I like uh, what was there nothing is sacred a sideways purple heart that's cool what else do I want? Anything? Maybe a little? As you say, maybe a lot? Who knows? I keep turning it, see if the composition is keeping me satisfied. Let's see, nice thick paint. What that means is that my GAC 800 is going to work to keep it from cracking. GAC 800 by Golden. It's in every one of my colors. If you like what I do, if you like my art, and you'd like to help me keep painting and making videos, there are Patreon and PayPal links underneath the video, and there are icons on my header. I'm going to steal a little paint. Because I can. And I'm going to steal a little more paint. Maybe not. Maybe I'm going to take that pink that I love with that 
put it right there. I could have used a little more black. I could have used a little more white. Can't get enough of that purple. You know what? I really, really like that pink and that purple together. So I'm just going to go for it. And I'm not minding that yellow. Do I want some more of it? That's the question. I know that's not yellow. <laughs> I lie. But I like that green. And I haven't rain anything for a while. And rain is something that you can use if you have the desire for cells and you're not using silicone. And I am not using silicone. But by the same token, you have to use my same exact recipe. The recipe, by the way, is underneath the video along with Pinterest links and a link to my Facebook YouTube albums where you can find the wet and the dry and prices. If you buy anything on the Amazon link below the video, you help me out. I so appreciate that. You can actually apply paint right to your skewer. And then lead paint. I'm pretty happy with that. Where's my black? <laughs> I, I say I'm pretty happy and then then I'm gonna give it a little a little zhuzh because I can because I want to When there's paint on your skewer, you can just roll it right over. I don't think that hurt anything. I think a little more might be in order. And if I fall short of my mark, that's, a, that's okay, because that leaves me room to use the skewer to push it up with. I like that so much, I am thinking that I want to try a dot of white and see how that works out. And even if it mixes with other colors, that's still not such a bad thing. A little streak of white here or there. Maybe throw it right on my skewer. I really did want to take full advantage of uh, this gold canvas, and I think we did okay. What am I looking for? <laughs> Goodness gracious, what knows? Who knows? Yeah, I'm losing my words. It's the end of the day. Let it run right down my skewer and pull it right out. Yep, that worked. Use my residual up there at top, see if it'll go. I don't know what else I need. Need is a relative word. Just don't forget, as long as you've got paint on your skewer and you've got a blank side and you can match it up, you can always use your paint up. Okay, I don't see much of anything that makes me unhappy. I kind of want some more black, but then I like black. <laughs> what can I say? And I don't think that's going to hurt anything. A little here or a little there. And I like making things cross over. It adds dimension, and I like adding dimension. I'm sure at some point in time somebody's going, Stop now! Enough is enough! But, you know, so far things work out for me pretty good. I'm not complaining. And I'm having a good time. And I don't want... I guess it doesn't matter if there's canvas showing through, because it's gold canvas, right? I've got that nice purple. Maybe that's what's supposed to go in there. I think so. So that was just a little fun. Thank you for joining me. Thank you all for the contributions who have kept me painting and making videos. Thank the rest of you for uh, your conversation and your questions and your appreciation and your love. I love you guys. I do. I love you guys so much. <laughs> You're great. You really, really are. Um, I will see you in the next video. I'm going to call this done as soon as I torch.
I say optimistically. <laughs> Maybe one spiral. Yeah, I'm very bad at stopping. <laughs> but I guess now is as good a time as any. And we got four minutes left. And whatever I forgot to tell you. I told you about the Amazon link. I told you about the... Oh! We hope to have a book for Christmas. Cross your fingers. Say a prayer if you want one of the one of the first volumes of, uh, of my YouTube artworks. Should be um, something like called maybe Because I Can. <laughs> Fluid acrylics. Is there anything else I feel I need there? Kind of. I like that. That's not hurting my feelings. And that's definitely not hurting my feelings. Okay, so the only thing I see that I want to fix is that little spot right there because I want a little tiny bit more black. I got a lot more than a little though. So we'll just fix that by joining this and using our colors. Yeah, I'm so so very, very bad at stopping. Not always, just right now. <laughs> so that's it. That's what I can see. I really could rain X, but uh, a lot of the colors are not mixed together originally. It was just... Uh, just one of these little things. I got a missing spot. Where's my paint? Alright. I can't. I need a cohesive pattern. It falls over the side. We'll find out what the uh, the neon purple from Folk Art multi-surface purple looks like when, uh, when it dries on gold. I guess tomorrow. So that was fun. As I said once already, thank you for joining me. Thank you for your the pleasure of your company. Thank you for uh, the contributions and I'll see you in the next video. Priscilla out. Bye for now.